Hi, my name is Jay Grams. My family has owned the Volo Auto Museum since 1960. We have a few hundred of the most exciting collector cars and they're all for sale in one location. I personally have handpicked them from around the country. Welcome to my sales shop. Come on, let's go for a spin. What's going on guys? Today we're taking a look at this 1999 Pontiac Trans Am Firehawk. Uh, when broken down, this is a one of 84 car with the color and options on it. It has just over 14,000 original miles on it. Uh, it took a little persuasion, but we did acquire it from a collector. He ended up letting it go to us. Uh, so I'm very excited to be showing it to you today. All right, guys, for those of you who haven't subscribed yet, I'm going to need you to hit that subscribe button. If you click the bell icon, It'll notify you every time our new videos get posted. You don't want to miss out. We got a lot of killer cars coming in and out of this place. Uh, every single week, we're pumping out tons of inventory to show you guys some of the best cars in the world. Uh, so if you want to see more like this, make sure you subscribe. For the full photo shoot and write-up description, guys, you can visit volocars.com. There you can study the specs. Uh, you can take a look at our in-depth photo shoots, the close-up shots, inside, outside, uh, underneath the engine bay, whatever you want. It's on volocars.com. We have a couple hundred, both modern muscle and classic cars. They're all for sale. You don't want to miss out. Check out the site. It's highly addicting. Volocars.com. All right, let's get into it. So like I was saying, 14,000, I believe 83 original miles on it, guys. We have all the original documentation, the original window sticker, the Firehawk sticker and options, uh, the build spec sheets as well. Uh, this is finished in the navy blue metallic with T-tops and the six-speed. Uh, so again, one of 84 when broken down. So part of the Firehawk package, <clears throat> you're going to get the Firehawk badging on the sides, the front grill. You have the upgraded chrome 17 by 9 uh, Firehawk wheels. They're wrapped in a BF Goodrich all-season tire. Uh, the tread on these are excellent. The the wheels themselves have no rashing or pitting, anything like that on the chrome faces. This has very nice four-wheel disc brakes on it. Uh, this does have an upgraded quad-tipped stainless steel catback exhaust that is part of the SLP upgrade for the Firehawk package. Uh, so these you don't see. This is a very rare exhaust on these cars. Uh, it sounds very nice, especially just for a stock upgrade to this vehicle. The paint itself, guys, walking around it, I really didn't see anything uh, to point out or mention as far as flaws or scratches or dents or anything like that. Uh, the wheels on this side, again, absolutely gorgeous. They sparkle. The tires are very nice. It does have the factory undercoating. It still looks very clean. Uh, the T-tops, the glass T-tops are in very nice shape. They're not faded or cracked or anything like that. All the weather stripping is nice up here, guys. Uh, it's not brittle. It is watertight, does not leak. Another part of the Firehawk package was the upgraded Ram Air Hood. Uh, this does have the heat exchanger vents on both sides. This is for the Firehawk hoods only. So the regular Trans Am Ram Air Hoods do not have those. Uh, they also put the Firehawk emblem right on the front. I did notice there's a tiny little indent on that front license plate uh, cover, but no big deal. You can't even see it unless you're bent over. Fog lights work nicely. The headlights work very nicely. They pop up. Uh, the power mirrors are working as well. Underneath the car, guys, again, being collector owned, it is very clean, uh, as clean as the rest of the car. So 14,000 miles. It's never seen any crazy weather or anything like that. All right, so underneath, Part of the Firehawk package is that upgraded suspension. This does have a high performance torque differential as well, which was a $900 option. Uh, and then obviously the, the chrome wheels were an additional option uh, on top of the Firehawk package. So the base package would come with a painted aluminum wheel. So these were an upgraded on top of that. Uh, let's take a look inside. All right, guys, so coming into the interior, uh, they do have the SLP build stickers on the door panel here. Uh, so this is showing that it was modified by SLP Engineering. This is their tire, tire pressure um, sticker. Since they are bigger wheels and different tires, you have to go by those guidelines on it. Uh, the 
Interior is beautiful. The only tiny flaw is the small crack here in the upper door panel. This is actually common. This happens quite often on these Trans Ams. Uh, I, I am getting my interior guy here to see if he can glue that together so it's not as big of a gap. Uh, but moving on to the cockpit here, the leather is beautiful. It has the power uh, bucket seats, both passenger and driver. The leather is in excellent condition. The dash is very nice. It's not cracked. The center console, everything is very, very clean, guys. Even the rear bucket seats, very, very clean. The carpeting, it still smells new in here. It still looks like new. Uh, just has that natural new shimmer to it. Uh, this does have an upgraded B&M Ripper manual shifter with the classic white ball on it. That's six-speed manual. Then, of course, you get the Firehawk plaque right on the center ashtray there. Uh, this has the Pontiac Classic Monsoon Stereo tilt telescope or tilt only steering wheel, I believe. Uh, you do have hand controls on the wheel for the stereo and uh, the CD player. So, very nice condition inside and out. Moving on to the trunk area. There is a button by the steering wheel, otherwise you can pop it with the remote. We have some goodies back here for you. Uh, so this does come with the optional Firehawk premium car cover and its own case. This does have the T-tops which lock nicely in the T-top holders. Uh, we have the stock shifter as well, so if you want to take the ripper shifter out, you can. Uh, and then the stock intake, some Firehawk optioned floor mats, so they're brand new, they've never been installed in the car, they just have the base ones in there for now. So the Firehawk ones are still back here. We have all the original documentation guys, I have the wheel lug nut, uh, the original owner's manual, and then the build specs and sheets for the Firehawk. So. It comes documented, you don't have to worry about it. Uh, it does have the stock throttle body in here. We have the stock shift knob as well. So this does have a few performance upgrades on it, but tastefully done, uh, obviously by SLP, and you still have the original stuff to go with it. Moving on to the engine bay, guys. Under the hood is that 5.7 liter V8 all right, these engines produced 327 horsepower, 345 pound-feet of torque, do a zero to 60 in five, three seconds, and was comparable to the Mercedes-Benz CL600 and the Bentley Continental R for a fraction of the price. Uh, this does have, obviously, like I said, the upgraded Pontiac Ram Air intake on it. We do have a BBK. Uh, 90 or 80 millimeter throttle body upgrade on it as well. It has a K&N cold air intake filter. Uh, so a couple performance upgrades in here. The battery is newer on it. Uh, everything, guys, the condition, it's collector grade. Uh, very, very clean, very original still. guys that was my impression on our 1998 Pontiac Trans Am Firehawk again collector owned uh, one of 84 optioned car in this colorway and t-top six-speed manual with the SLP upgrade and the Firehawk package we have all the documentation on it uh, this is an instant collectible these cars are only climbing in value uh, you can watch them the past, over the past few years. They just keep going up and up. So now is your chance to get one at a fair price uh, before they become even more expensive. If you are interested in purchasing it, you can visit volocars.com. There, if you click the Buy It Now button, it'll secure a refundable deposit on this car. 
It'll shoot us an email. Uh, it, we will contact you back. We can help set up financing and shipping. Uh, it's super easy if you need it. Uh, we get door-to-door -door shipping. You can get this delivered right to your driveway, uh, volocards.com. Or you can call us, ask for me, Caleb. I'd be more than happy to talk over the car some more with you. Uh, we can go over financing and shipping options as well that way. Thanks for checking it out.